Bluetooth connected. Not finding anything under the bed, Anna laid back down to sleep. If only she had seen the man's boots on the other side of her bed. Power off. Dude, this story is literally about you. You're an idiot. Oh no, I'm scared. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Vince and today we have something a little bit different. Today we are reacting to three short horror films. <laughs> it's okay. It's still pretty early. I said three and put up four fingers. Wow. It's not okay. <laughs> Today we're going to be reacting to three random short horror films, so y'all already know what time it is. It's time to get spooky. <gasps> oh, brother, this guy stinks! I don't know. It's October, it's spooky month. It's supposed to be scary? I know I'm a grown man, but, like, Halloween. Woo! I'm a ghost. What? I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm just here. <laughs> well, uh, you know, I, I don't know, like, spooky month, I guess. It, it ain't really been that spooky to me. I ain't got scared yet. Yo, I can't go nowhere. I'm scared. What the? Ah! Oh! 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 But anyway, the first short horror film is called The Doll. Now, I don't see how this would be scary to me because I am a grown man, like I said. And grown men don't play with dolls. Bruh. So, by reasonable deductions and analysis and calculations, I can't die to this. Oh. I don't have no dolls in my proximity. Why would I buy a doll? I won't. So we just gonna jump straight into the short horror film and see what's going on and how these dumb people died to a doll. So I mean, let's get into it. Let's go. Molly, happy so birthday, girl. Bye. bye, you guys. Bye, bye Molly. Molly. Forget you, Molly. I don't know why I just don't like her. Oh, they left my house this messy. Heck, you know. Oh. They gotta come back and clean this. I don't care if it is my birthday and I open them presents. seem a little bit too old for like presents like that on a birthday party. Huh? She not gonna check who it's from? Let's switch. I don't get it. Very funny. What is? The doll. I just found it. The note was a nice- I don't want to be that guy. Like, I really don't, but I feel like it'd be an injustice to society to not point this out. Why are her teeth that dirty? Oh my god! No, no, no! no I'm sorry, like, I, I just had to say something. It could have been the cake she just ate, but- that camera angle is not flattering. Sorry, ma'am. You need to sue them or something because they got you out here looking like you dirty. Are you? I don't know. But anyway, back to the doll. 
She didn't see no from whoever or nothing. She just assumed it's from her friend. And we were opening the gifts. Wouldn't my friend that bought the gift as a prank be like, hey, open that one? Bruh. No. That gift just appeared out of thin air. Nobody bought that from me. And why is it all this wrapping paper on the floor? How old is she? It's not Christmas. I'm, I'm getting off topic. It's touch, by the way. I totally forgot about that old story. What are you talking about? And she don't know what she's talking about. Didn't you leave me a doll as a joke? No. Now will you tell me what's going on? Someone left a doll for me, and it had a note attached saying, let's switch. You know, like in that old story. What story? The possessed doll one. You receive it as a gift, and if you don't give it to someone else by midnight, the spirit inside switches bodies with you. Remember? Oh, oh yeah. Ugh, that story always creeped me out. It's almost midnight. Who are you going to give it to? <laughs> Yeah, right. Well, send me a photo. I want to see what it looks like. Okay, give me a second. The doll gone? The doll's gone. What? Come on, bro. You know it ain't move like that. Let me call you back. What's wrong? She's stupid. Run! You're going outside. She's gonna throw it outside. Don't know who bought it for her, but she's scared. Okay. garbage can have time to beat you to the front door unlock your front door walk in your house and sit the doll on the couch and hide before you got to your house are you stupid you gotta be an idiot and now the doll talking to you i ain't got no more words for you Switch. what happened Did they switch? Now, now, Molly. Don't cry. Oh! Oh, no! What the heck? Not gonna lie. She died because she ignorant and dumb. Like, uh, Facts! She ignored all signs of danger. Why did you do that, Molly? Dude! Your friends didn't buy you that doll. You caught the person that you thought bought you the doll. She said she didn't buy it. You threw the doll away and teleported into your house. Now you're dead. Come on, bro. Like, you had until midnight. You knew the story. You just didn't follow the instructions. I'm getting rid of that doll in the next three seconds. I'm up out of there. It's your doll now. Let's switch. Come on. Heck, you know, I'm done, bro. That girl is just stupid. <laughs> Well, um, I just had to do something. I wonder if y'all heard that on the microphone. My little sister was calling me from the bathroom, and I walked in, and I ain't never smelled death before in my life, but I know I smelled it today. Oh! That toilet was trifling. And how could something so disgusting come out of a small child? That might have been scarier than a short horror film. I don't know, but anyway, back to what I was saying. I'm not going to sit here and try to decode this. I'm just chalk it up and say, hey, ma'am, you're stupid. That's it. So short horror film number two. All right. So this next one is called Thirsty. And like I always try to do, um, put myself in a situation and see if I would survive. I, I couldn't see myself dying to this. I'm thirsty. All I got to do is drink some water. I beat the monster. I am good now. So Bruh. let's see how this idiot is about to die. Let's go. Oh, they talking about this type of thirsty where he's scrolling on Instagram. Oh, not literally thirsty. Oh my! Uh, nothing. Let me see your phone. 
No. No. Fine. Oh, she run the house. Yeah, she definitely wear the pants. Wow. Look at them. Who is she? No one. I was just scrolling. Really? Shows you liked a bunch of her photos and oh, even commented, damn girl, I drink you right up. <laughs> I was just being funny. It's just a joke. That was funny. Just a joke. <laughs> no, she don't think it's funny. She not laughing for real. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No. <laughs> what? You're thirsty. What type of spell is that? What she just do to him? <coughs> I need water. <coughs> Voodoo magic? Next, that's what his next plan of action is clearly. But uh, she did all this because he liked some Instagram photos and made uh, some comments. I'm not gonna lie, how would that make him thirsty for liking some Instagram photos? It's not like he and her DMs talking about, oh, oh, let me lick them toes, baby. What? No, he didn't say that unless he did, and I didn't know. But hey, she doing too much. I ain't gonna lie, how he end up with her? She's clearly crazy. way to go out dehydration you can't even lick it up off the ground I don't get it what what is this one you evil you're not even that cute like I said you're thirsty Is he dead? Oh. Oh, he not. What the heck? Oh, snap. I don't get it. Not gonna lie. That was one of the ones where you just don't get it. I could watch this five times. I still wouldn't understand the message behind it. And I'm tempted to go into the comments, but I feel like I'm not gonna get nothing from that either. The way bro struggling with the water bottle got me. Okay. I guess. As a witch who has been cheated on before, I 100% approve. What? What? First of all, I don't judge, but this is a man. Bruh. And look at the profile picture. That's definitely a man. That's none of my business. Immoral, never like people's photos. Well, yeah, see, nobody knows either. We all confused up in this piece. It's not just me. So, I mean, I was thirsty. Like he said, moral historians don't like other people's photos and, or don't get caught. I, I don't know. So, time for the third and last horror film. Let's go. All right. So, this last one is called Don't Listen. And I already won. <laughs> you ain't got to tell me twice. The monsters say don't listen. Oh, uh, where did my ears go? My ears fell off. I can't hear anymore. What? Uh, I'm not hearing it. I'm not hearing nothing. I'm deaf. I... That might have been disrespectful, but that was some type of sign language I did. I, I didn't take sign language class. I'm sorry if I just threw up gang signs. I don't know. Right? I mean, this is don't listen. Here we go. Oh, no, that's scary. That's one of my biggest fears. Something crawling up from under your bed or watching you while you sleep. Like, imagine waking up, you just... Okay. A true story from the copycat killer. Anna was lying in bed when she heard it. Subtle. Right off the back. She's an idiot. She know darn well her name is Anna, but I'm just gonna ignore that. Why is she listening to 
serial killer stories. It's not 1954. We have TV. Watch it on Netflix. Come on, bro. Get the pictures up. Where are you sitting there staring at the wall like this, listening to killer horror stories? I can't even get scared by that, bro. I need to see it. I'm just listening to it. Nah, I mean, I guess it'd be kind of spooky, but it's 2024. You like, you too old for that. You got no business just sitting here listening to scary stories with your JBLs on. Bruh. Watch it on Netflix. At first, barely even audible, and then louder, breathing coming from under her bed. And she's just gonna look. You know darn well your name is Anna and you in bed, goofy little girl. It's just a story, Anna. Oh, it's just a story. Why do people look under the bed like that? Because I need to get out the bed to look. Bluetooth connected. Not finding anything under the bed, Anna laid back down to sleep. If only she had seen the man's boots on the other side of her bed. Power off. Dude, this story is literally about you. You're an idiot. I'm scared. Bluetooth connected. Anna sat on her bed, terrified, not knowing if this was real or all part of her imagination. To her horror, she would soon find out as the closet door slowly creaked open. Oh, she did. two of them. Swing again? <laughs> that was the last of poor Anna. Now remember, boys and girls, should you ever encounter the copycat killer, choose his death wisely. You're choosing for two. Uh -oh. <laughs> Okay, well, I got a few things to say. Number one, I don't think that pin is a one-tap kill like that. It ain't no way you get hit with a pin once in your face and you just dead. Like, like it's a shotgun or something, your head exploded. No, that is a pin. Your eye might be bleeding, you might be blind in that eye forever, but you ain't just going, wow. Like, it ain't no just KO. And second of all, I have to get the lord of that one. You, you're able to kill the dude, but the way you kill him is the way you're gonna die, so maybe just don't kill him. I don't know how to get up out of there. I guess the only way to get up out is just don't listen. Well, she tried not to listen by turning it off and it just connects to her Bluetooth speaker. I don't got a Bluetooth speaker, so you can't get me. If I take my headphones out, they just out. But you're gonna turn my TV on magically? No, you're not. That's cheating. So, I mean, I don't know. That was three short horror films. Which one was the scariest? Uh -huh. That last one did have me spooked first one was just kind of creepy and the second one there's some voodoo magic I don't I guess the third one was the scariest don't listen because uh, she looked under the bed like an idiot and his footsteps was walking towards her that was scary so I, I don't know like I said let me know which one's the scariest to y'all down below in the comments and y'all know what to do if y'all enjoyed the video too much to subscribe y'all know what a 10,000 subscribers and hit that like button if you enjoyed the video could just make sense to the like button if you like the video no that's a big pin, right? Big is the pin brand. I ain't really out here one tapping people. You telling me I hit you in the face with the pin? You dead? No!